So getting to the design properly, the first thing you have to see when you open the Pizzle Lab is the text box on the screen. So what to do is to just tap on it and tap the delete button at the top left corner and you get rid of it. So for the design you saw on the thumbnail, you want to quickly get in the background. So fix in the background first before the rest of the activity on the design. So to get the background, you just have to insert a shape. It's a plain shape actually. So you could tap the plus button here to find your shape or on the contrary, you could also get a shape from the tube on the down right corner. The hexagonal shape here. Uh, opens with a lot of tools you need the shape and the rest of them the a is for texting the double square here is for background so like i said you could get the shape from here so let's just tap on the shapes here and then first one i want to fill up the entire space with it so that is uh, a kind of a light ash color something like that so just go for color the first color is the fill color which is the color for the shape in particular the second coloring is the uh stroke color which is the outline color so once you deal with the fill color here so just tap on the plus button and there so you could get more options even if you what you have maybe there with the plus you could get more options so i think i got what i want just tap on that okay i think yeah that's good so i want to insert another shape again another square we go so i'm good with that this time around let me go with the plus sign part so you see you could get it from here also so tap on the shapes as shape here as well so i want to move it up here so straight from one end to give me uniform distribution uh, so set it up properly your choice yeah so that's that oh okay that's that accept oh no 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 I have to edit quickly. I shouldn't have accepted. I've not colored it. So I want to give it a, a kind of a darker ash, but purplish ash. I will also say purplish ash. I hope you get me. <laughs> so that's that. Okay. I want to accept that. I think I'm done with the backgrounds. So I want to quickly go to the layer panel up here. These two rumble shapes here, this layer panel, you could lock them up so they don't run around while you do your designs. So I'm doing that, tap on the layer panel, say it goes away. So this is the background. So quickly, I want to get in the images for this design. The first image I want to get in is that of a message. Team. So to get images, what you want to do is to tap on the plus button up here. It shows you a lot of stuff, like I said earlier. So from gallery, that means images. So we have some images downloaded here already, at least the ones I need for the design. So I got one of them here already. So that's that. So accept this image with a good sign down here, accept it. So I want to get rid of the background for this image. And I want to do that with the tools here. I could see eraser, good. Tap on the eraser with this eraser to get rid of backgrounds. So the first bar here shows you the the size of the eraser, that the size, the radius, and the second this with the the blurness. You could notice that the blurness or sharpness of the edge. So I like to keep it blur so we have a very fine uh, image background remover. So that is that. I'm getting rid of the backgrounds already, as you can see. So that's I'm trying to be fast on this. So you could do that with on your own design. You could just be a bit slower to maintain a very good cleanup. I'm just trying to be fast. Mm, yep, I'm sorry. I undid. I made a. It, it was SS. I had to undo the bar that I tapped. So at this point, I want to be a bit careful here. You just tap to wherever you want. So I want to reduce the diameter of this a little so I could have a closer touch. No, can't do. Can't do it all much. Oh, why am I doing this? Mm. Just to get something cool. Uh, yep. Okay. Not, may not be perfect, but not that bad. So accept that. I think I'm good with that. I want to drop this image here. And then the second image, I will not have to go through the Remover process. I'll just have to show you the image. So that's it down here. I did the same thing. Just got it from my gallery, and you could also download from the gallery from your. You could download it online to make use of it. So that was what I did actually, and uh, I'm good with these images. I think. Just drop it, position it right. For the other one, I want to increase the size a little as well. No, 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 I want to get on this. I believe you notice I am dealing with them. It's not that difficult, kind of, kind, kind of. So at this point, I want to quickly get in my test. Hit on the text there and double tap on the top right corner, seeing the text there. So I want to get rid of the sample. 
the name is actually Judike J U D I Judike. Okay, that's good. Then I have to put the plus sign. It's a plus sign there. Judike plus. Okay, good. That's good. That's good. So okay, I accept that. So I've seen it already. Uh, okay, okay, okay. And then you want to change the font pattern. That font is not so good. I want to give it a fancy font. Fancy font. Yep, I've seen one already. Okay, I'm going with this. I'm going with this. Okay, it's kind of too light. Boarding it. Accept the board. Good. So. After boarding this, I want to quickly okay, accept that. Then I want to give it a shadow. Give it a shadow, give it a shadow, enable shadow. Good. I want to reduce the radius. The opacity is 100 already. You could make it thicker by enabling outer glue, but that would be too thick, I guess. That would be too thick. I want to take off the outer glue and just go with normal shadow. Okay. So. I want to accept that so quickly I want to add up the next text so add text uh, get rid of this stuff the next text Messi Chimu that's all in capital letter Messi Chimu okay that's good as none of this and enter in between okay okay Get it to order. Get it to the place. Kind of too big. This needs to be. Uh, uh, you could set it to whatever you want, actually. Well, okay, I want to center align it. That is the Messian Chimu. Good, accept that. I want to put it a little, it's kind of too thick. Screw board, board, okay, good. You want to give it shadow as well, so it looks like the order. Enable shadow on this, I think that's cool. Then, want to position it a little bit better. Okay, I think we'll make it do, we'll make it do with this. So, the name, okay. The brand logo, the, the brand, the music brand, the logo. I think I downloaded that already. So from gallery, quickly go for that. Where's that? Where's that? I can't just saw it. Oh, it's in, indeed. Reduce the size so much. It's too big. It's too big. We must be getting our design. What's happening? Okay. Okay. <laughs> we just have to keep this here. We don't have time. So use the positioning to set it a bit centralized. It may not be perfect on this. Time to get make you see how this happens. So I want to add the name of the music. More than good. So still on test. Add test. Double tap to edit it. So get rid of that. Uh -huh. So more and good. I say of the same font so we could just use attend to them at the same time then later we'll put it down T H A N so I would have to accept this accept that where is this sorry I'm editing space kind of seems too much accept that now yeah I have to change the font style. That font style is not okay for that kind of brand. See something normal. If I could have it on my recent, this may be good. This okay. Okay, I think I love that. Then give it a color. Good color will not be bad. Color, color, color. Where is it? That's it here. Color. So a good color will be okay. To get a good color, I think it should be somewhere around here. From there, you could see blend of good. So I think this is not bad at all. Good. I want to give it a black shadow. Maybe that could give me an effect I want actually. Let me see what inner glow looks like on it. 
kind of too thick. I don't think I like that. So let me just give it a shadow, a black shadow. No, that's too bad as well. So enable this. Okay, I think we'll make it do with this. Then I want to add the down. I'll test. Uh, I'm done with this. I'll test. So I want to quickly put that circle around of T H E N. More than good. It's actually the name of the music. It's a great music. Changing the font is very important. I have to give it a fancy font. Where am I fancy? Let me check on recent. Okay, that's cool. I have one setting that. Then I want to give the black color. That's going to fit it more. Color, color, color. Where are you? Good. So black, re black. Good. That is quite small, so I will have to use the position to to get it to sh order. I can't. My finger will only get to it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So, so that's that for that, guys. I think if you love this video, please don't forget to subscribe to it. You could do more than this. I just did this to show you samples and make you see you could do a lot with Pizza Lab. Thanks so much for the time. Thanks so much. And if you love this video, don't forget to subscribe.